Experiments are an essential tool for scientists to conduct investigations. A laboratory setting provides a safe, controlled environment for experiments. Many experiments involve use of hazardous chemicals, such as strong acids, alkalis, or flammable materials. All good scientists learn the correct methods for cleanup and disposal of chemicals. Hazardous chemicals require specialized methods of cleanup and disposal. Chemicals may be toxic, flammable, or corrosive, so they cannot be simply washed down the drain or thrown in a regular trash can. To determine the correct method for cleaning up or disposing of a chemical, you need to refer to the Material Safety Data Sheet, known as MSDS. In addition to cleanup and disposal information, the MSDS contains information about the substance's physical and chemical properties, its uses, reactivity, potential safety hazards, and the appropriate protective equipment necessary for safe handling of the substance. The MSDS sheets for most hazardous chemicals can be located online. Each chemical stored in your school and used in lab experiments requires a hard copy MSDS for immediate reference if needed. Certain chemicals will contaminate the water supply if they are poured down the drain. Other chemicals may create a fire hazard when thrown into the trash. You will need to address other safety concerns when cleaning up or disposing of chemicals. The MSDS has procedures for dealing with the various possibilities. If you are unsure of how to clean up or dispose of a chemical, always ask your teacher. You could create a hazard by trying to improvise and do it yourself. Your teacher will have training to handle chemical cleanup and disposal in a safe and controlled manner. By asking a teacher how to dispose of or clean up chemicals will help to prevent accidents or safety hazards. Chemicals can pose safety and health risks, but the laboratory is safe when you follow the proper procedures for handling and disposing of chemicals.